Everyone here has the same face, and even the clothes are exactly the same, they all lowered their heads and played with their mobile phones while walking on the road, and they didn't react at all even if their noses ran out. When taking the subway, the carriages are full, and people with their heads bowed can be seen everywhere, even couples don't communicate at all when hugging, they just bow their heads blindly on the other side, the child was so obsessed with his mobile phone that his head was caught tightly by the door, the child was so scared that he screamed for help, the next second all the passengers heard the news and rushed over, hearing the approaching footsteps, the child seemed to have a sense of security, but what I didn't expect was that the passengers took out their mobile phones and took pictures frantically, recording his ugly behavior from various angles and postures, it lasted for a long time, but still no one was willing to lend a helping hand, at this time, the subway passed a station, and his head was knocked off directly, but the child's body was not affected, he lay on the ground looking for his mobile phone, the moment he touched the mobile phone, his world returned to light, the child's fallen head rolled into a garbage dump due to inertia, what's creepy is that behind his head is a mountain of skulls, the child who lost his head was not discouraged, he put the mobile phone on his head, and when he turned around, all the passengers on the subway had mobile phones hanging around their necks, 